Some of my secrets leaked out. <laughs> A double, triple alert. It's not even on the mustache line. Why, it's my revolver telephone. Now, which trigger works the phone? Ah, this looks like it. McCool speaking. Shoot. <laughs> operator, I want to report an accident. This isn't the operator. This is number one. Hurricane Harry is causing monsoons and tornadoes and floods. And worse than that, he keeps blowing out my cigar. It's up to you to stop him, McCool. Over and out. Over and out. After this, I'd better use an answering service. I wish I had a job where I could want to work. Now to look for Hurricane Harry. I'll look for footprints. <laughs> These look suspiciously like footprints. And a knee print. And a tummy print. And a face print. Oh, hello there. Goodbye, damn McCool. It's time for me to blow. <laughs> My, you've got enlarged tonsils, old man. You ought to have them out, you know. <laughs> Mom, the 
jig is up. I've got you, Hurricane Harry. <laughs> oh, that's what you think. I'm going to blow you to smithereens. You can't frighten me. You're just a big blowhard. Correct. He messed up my mustache. Now, I'm going to blow you into outer space. Oh, go fly a cut. <laughs> I will. I will. In a moment, you will disappear into thin air. Don't hold your breath. I won't. I won't. Now for the big blast off. If you have any last words, McCool, speak up. Talk. Go ahead. Shoot the breeze. Shoot the breeze? Champion idea. Gone is the wind. And then Hurricane Harry tied me to a line, or kite. And he blew. Sorry, number one. That'll never happen again. Well, it's been quite a day. Hurricane Harry gave me the win, and number one gave me the end. so good but not for long i tried and tried but it all went wrong i hope one day that i'll stop being a flop and that i'll make the top just like my pop <sighs> my pop the Mysterious doings at the Grand Opera House. As the world-famous tenor, Enrico Paisan is about to finish the famous aria, the laughing song from Hysteria, something terrible happens. as Katrina Callery is about to end the jewel song from the opera Grossfinger. I demand police protection. We must get to the bottom of this before all of my opera stars walk out. Send your best men. Tonight you will be on stage doing the performance, and if the Phantom Voice sings again, we'll track him down. Never fear, McCool is here. I love the opera. I used to sing Carmen, you know. You did? Sure. Ah, she'll be Carmen round the mountains when she comes. She'll be Carmen round the mountains when she comes. Your costume is in there. I've never been on a stage before, Harry. I'm a little bit nervous. Take your cue from me, Dick, my boy. I'm an old hand in the theater. There's nothing to be scared about. Here's the elevator. Let's go up. It's just like anything else. You take it in stride. Just do what I do. Come on, pretty funny. Why say, Harry? What? What? What did he say? He said we're on stage now. We're what? Hurry up, get out there. The tenor is about to sing his big aria. All those people, they're looking at me. Phantom of the Opera! 
Danger is my business. It's a gas donating my coolest work of art to this fair city. Bird burglar! At last, matey, the buried treasure I've been searching for all these years. <laughs> Special. 
We have a special report. A band of burglar birds is terrorizing the nation. Please believe these feathered footpads to be ex-jail birds, trained for a life of looting by that bird brain villain, the owl. No one knows what these birds will steal next. like this pussycat, and I'll be living like a bird of paradise. The perfect purple sapphire. But, Owl, what if Cool McCool decides to make things hot? What if he does? <laughs> I don't give a hoot. While the infamous Owl counts the bill got to get Cool McCool, that courageous conqueror of conniving criminals, is keeping in constant readiness. Ah, that must be my mustache ball. Then it must be my watch ball. Of course, it's my pencil ball. It's the telephone. McCool speaking. McCool? The owl is on the wing again. I'm counting on you to capture the owl, McCool. Right, number one. Now hop to it! <laughs> <laughs> All right, reach. Gladly. I'm warning you. <laughs> you fool, McCool. You walked right into my trap. <laughs> I didn't walk into your trap at all. I came by car. There's a time bomb inside that egg, McCool. In exactly one minute, this egg will hatch, and it will be bye-bye, birdie. <laughs> When the safe goes off, I'll be rambled, uh, uh, scrambled. I'll give my eye tooth to get out of here. That's it. I'll whistle through my eye tooth. <laughs> complaining about. I spoiled my mustache. Frankly, McCool, I didn't think you could do it. Well, I must admit that I did have some help. Ha! I thought so. Maybe we can use your help, mate. Coming, number one. <laughs> Number one, that'll never happen again. <laughs> I love that boy.
my business. <laughs> 